Grab me then when you're ready. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I didn't know you were fucking closer than I thought you were. <laughs> Record it, somebody record it. <laughs> Hi, it's Apple1975, and today I'm bringing you a PUBG video. What you're watching in terms of content is a fail from Math as he runs me over uh, in a squads game. Usual stuff, we always run each other over. And um, this bit from a Solos game of his, a uh, lovely bit of house clearance and a good game. So I thought I'd bring you the game from the bit where he starts clearing the house. Good tip when you're house clearing, keep on moving. Just keep shimmying left and right just keep moving just keep trying to make yourself a difficult target I'm going to use this gameplay of maths as background for what I want to talk about today and what I want to talk about today is possible improvements to PUBG what I think the developers could do with doing for the community and for us especially on Xbox One because the Xbox One different uh, version is different from the PC version in a lot of ways um, we don't have aim assist and that on a console with controller is a bit weird but equally, there are people that can use mouse and keyboard on consoles. So, you know, there are some console-only niche issues and things. And there are some general improvements they could make to the game on the whole. Like, for example, I'm, I'm an advocate. I want to see a firing range. I would love to see them have firing range. You can enter through the lobby. Uh, just a solo bit of fun where you can go in, pick any gun, any attachment, any loadout, and have a practice with it. They can even use the graphics from the firing range that's already in the game and just let you go on there, shoot your guns, have a bit of practice, you know? Because you don't get a lot of time in-game to handle certain weapons, and it's very rare you get the perfect loadout on your car. And, you know, the first time you shoot that, you're never quite sure, because, you know, how often do you fire it with the cheek pad, the eight times scope, and the, you know, compensator? It's the little things, the little adjustments you need to make, and you don't have you know, the built-up muscle memory to do it because you don't very often get hold of weapons in their perfect form. It's one of the odd things about PUBG with the scramble for equipment. You know, you don't know whether it's worth putting the vertical foregrip or the other other grip because, you know, is it side to side I'm trying to compensate for? Is it up and down recoil? I don't know the gun well enough. I don't, you know, you haven't had enough time to practice with the weapons to get used to them. And I think it would be a great improvement to the game if they added a firing range. Now obviously with Xbox One we've only got the one map on the preview version. They have said that when the game goes live, our full version gets released, we will get the second map that PC players have got. However, I'm not too bothered about that at the moment because the second map has its own issues. I mean, they themselves have been saying they need to make it more interesting. Uh, so the second map would be a nice change up for us. However, I'd like them to, you know, make that map more interesting before I get to play on it um, it is you know obviously these games um, this game's great fun I, we're at the stage now um, we were saying the other day we're at the stage now we could probably do a second map or even a third map just to shake things up and change things because at the moment you know I, I got game after game where I drop a Gatka radio tour around that park kill a load of people do quite well um, you know I have specific spots that I tend to go to and I'm kind of like Anywhere around Gatka is kind of home turf to me. I know the terrain so well. Same with Watertown and Ruins. I kind of, I know that area of the map really, really well. Um, because that's just where I tend to drop in if I can. Um, <laughs> map gets so lucky there. I mean, you know, that's one of those ones where uh, you leave the building or he leaves the building. But anyway, I'm going to leave you now. Um, that's enough of me talking about improvements. That I'd like to see the Xbox One version. You know, it's little things, a firing range and a second map. It's not much to ask for. Um, but I'm going to leave you the rest of the Maths gameplay uh, play out. I think Maths getting more confident with the shooting. Um, just more confident in his ability to kill people, which is good. And that's all. Thanks for watching.